I wanted to get a copy of Self Help by Samuel Smiles, which is the first. I, it was written in 1859. What? And it was, and it's sort of, it's the first, I would say, commercialization of personal development. Wow. So it's quite a young industry, really, when yeah. you think about it. You know, it's not even 200 years old. Um, but uh, even that, though, I think is probably shocking to many because obviously yeah. we've only been living in this era. We're like, mm. oh, this is a thing. That's no, it's been not to say now. people weren't sharing wisdom before that, no, but absolutely. they weren't doing it for money. Yeah. They weren't doing it to get paid for it. Yeah. Not really. I mean, you know, there may be a few cases, but then they're not very well documented. And the, there was, a, you know, the philosophers going back thousands of years, as you say, you know, would, would speak and share. But it, it wasn't usually a commercial thing. Yeah. It wasn't something that people did to make money to live. Yeah. 